Hello the people, I'm Mr. Neo and you can call me M-Page and welcome to the Neo Show. Now this is the first episode of the Neo Show designed specifically to air on the YRC's G Plus page since I recently became a member. Now for those of you who have no idea who I am, I'll leave it to myself in the recording studio to explain. But if you really don't care and just want to watch a reaction, you can skip to the time code here. My name is Michael Page, and my channel name is Improbables Classic slash Neo. It used to be called Improbables Classic, back when it had the goal of simply re-uploading all the old Improbables videos. But that all changed when I decided I can do more with the channel. I can add my own community content, show my face, and make a name for myself in the community of reaction videos. Among other things I was doing, like compilations, remasters, YTP, and remixes, I got the idea of starting a brand new series. Like, a new generation of Improbables. Like, the same style we all know and love, but with a new cast. This gave me the idea of the Neo Improbables, or shortened, the Neo Show. Over time, as I produced pilots and episodes for the Neo Show, it evolved and got better. For example, I started with a webcam and recorded straight from my laptop, but then I evolved to using a rock band microphone and eventually to using a HD camcorder. The funky guy in the glasses sitting next to me is Cactus Chris. He'll occasionally show up to do reaction videos with me, but I can't pull him away from his job as a fast food worker, so you can count on most of the videos being solo. Recently, I got a Vidme account. With this Vidme account, I can upload uncut and extended uncensored versions of videos that I post on YouTube, as well as videos that are not fit for YouTube at all. In addition to reaction videos, I also try and branch out to cover a variety of subjects like gaming, music, vlogs, including reading comments, and more. I originally did this to try and hide myself from the negative stigma that reaction channels have been getting unfairly, but now it's a good attempt for me to reach out to as many people as possible and spread the love. The 3,000 subscribers I have may be holdovers from me re-uploading the classic Improbables, but just because I'm losing subscribers doesn't mean I'm going bad. It means that people found out that I have a name for myself and they're not interested in seeing any more of me. And that's okay, because now I can put my name and face out there to more people in hopes that I can gain new, fresh fans to replace the ones I've lost. And along the way, make some friends. Which, based on the Hangouts live streams I did with some of the YRC members, I seem to have done that already. Like ACT8113, Don Triple One Reacts, Joe Don 54, The Zerato Thing, Cool Brad's Reaction Asylum. Oh, sorry. Tonyo's Reaction Asylum, and hopefully I'll be able to meet more of you and we can all have a good time. That's all from me, let's get back to the reaction. Now that we got introductions out of the way, let's get to this episode. Today I will be reacting to Danny Shops for Will Dogs with Cool Bard. It is a YTP created by ACT8113 one of the many moderators or owners or whatever of the YRC. Now, the reason the box is showing up now and I haven't even pressed play yet is because ACT8113 has a unique style of YTPs where he likes to hide small details that you can't really see unless you pay much attention to them. So, I figure instead of just importing the file later, I'll just capture my video player so that when I pause and take a look at it, you won't get lost. That's me, always thinking ahead for the viewers. Let's get right into this. Three, oh, hang on, I gotta get my mouse on the play button. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> it's funny because it's a variation of YouTube Red. Really, the video just started and it's already broken. Who is that, Will Dog? Uh, it might be Will Dog, because I don't know his name. Sonic Moonwalking. Oh my god. 
Oh my god, this is savage. Yay, music! That never gets old. Um... Uh, are all the anime characters just laughing at him right now? Who is he anyway? That guy looks like a home video version of friggin' AC Race Bust. There's that catch the wave hack. Here we go. Jack goes past he and the guy drew it. I wish I could. <laughs> Mark. <laughs> yep, there's Dan. What's up, guys? Dan ran out of. Hey, hang on. I just want to take a moment to analyze this particular frame right here. Where is it? Where do you go? Dan says, You ran out of ideas, did you? And he says, Yep. <laughs> like, it's pretty cool when I see stuff like this when, like, um,. You get other people involved and like, like without actually getting them involved, you like, take a dig at yourself. Like, it's not a bad thing to do. Like, when you use other people or other characters to take a dig at yourself, it's not saying that you suck or that you're not worth watching. It's saying that you are a human being who is capable of having flaws and that means that you are relatable as a person. Because not, because not everyone can be perfect. I just have one thing to say. <laughs> <laughs> Is he f***ing? And by the way, nice try trying to iterate me like that. I have my volume down. Aha! Uh -huh. <laughs> Him and I, we on the same level. I have my volume down at all times. Unless they're talking really quietly and I have to turn the volume up. Um, what is this animation? The Pony Idiot Box. That I should probably react to next. Or me put it on the Wheel of Wonder. What? Haven't you ever heard of blows on the damn door? Oh my god, there's a rattle thing! Don't read don't let your kids watch it, you'll be blue. Um. Before you know it, they're gonna be like him. What the? Is that kind of washing machine? Oh my god, the Smash Bros mods. There's some nightmare fuel. Oh my god, the Sims. GTA memes! What's with all the anime references? Oh my god, just put all the hacks in there, why don't you? Ah, oh, crap. Someone reacting to Markiplier or Poop? What? More Mark Poop. Wait, did- what? Uh, I'm not even gonna focus on that, because it said something about unzipping pants. Wait, where's the mouse? I gotta- I'm gonna need that. Um, I have- questions more than I'd like to oh the mom spaghetti versus all-star I like it I like it ACT you you good you good at this what oh the PewDiePie react oh god spoil oops and there we go here's a sus stutter loop I was that the duck? Oh my god, they're at the shop. That might have been Pot Shop, who I thought was Will Dog, but then again, I have to keep looking. How'd you come to Canada? I'm with relatives. Oh, he has Canadian relatives. That's pretty cool. Hi, Ouija. Hi, anime chick. Wait, that was Will Dog. 
Uh, you from the YouTube reactionary community. They are, and I just joined it. So, what better way to say hello to the YRC than react to a YRC based video? Yeah. What's up? What's that? Oh my god, it's cool, Brad. I think he goes by Tonyo now. Where do these guys come from? So they all know each other. Oh my god, there's a party. And this crap. Party music. Wait, you're right, what? Is it over? Oh my god. Made me want to close my previous channel, but now I have something that may shock you all. Oh crap. At S right with the help of my new friend, I was able to locate where they lived and kidnap them. Okay, um, give me a minute while I parse an appropriate response to that. <clears throat> oh, hell no! That's all I got. Now I have a request for you guys. If you don't delete your community, I will kill them. What do we do? Work perhaps I'm but how? Rainbow Dad. Oh my. Hey, it's Scarce! Ta we should talk to Scarce. Scarce will save the day, clearly. The, the duck's hideout. In the middle of nowhere. Makes sense. Uh. Inmates. You mean prisoners of war. How are you gonna lie, Johnny? Shot you. Shot me. However, cause it took him a long time to load the gun. The blast simply knocked me over on my body unconscious and faked up my face like this forever. It even affected the way I spoke. I can't speak like a troll anymore. I now have to speak like a normal human. And that is a bad thing. Like, if you spoke like a normal human that you would probably fit into human society and people would actually give a f about your opinion. Uh, I can't believe I'm taking a YTP so seriously, but this is what happens when I have more time on my hands because I can pause the video. It makes me sick. They're closing in. Nice try. You are to remain stuck here and I will make sure that triple own pot shop studios cool Brad, and will not never get to you. And this time I ain't he alone. Hey. He a muscle my new friend I have made ever since I found him on in the true horses test me. Make sure Who I is Ian Russell? Like, like, like I said, I'm a new guy in the YRC. I'm not fully well versed in all the history, so half of these in jokes will fly right past me. Well, not in jokes, but like references or whatever. They'll fly right past me, but. Whoa! Rainbow Dash is too fast for them. <laughs> when the when the guards chase after a thing, they sound like Pac-Man. Ah! Free online text to speech synthesizer. Codewealth.com. They actually reveal that it's a synthesizer. Oh whoa! Yeah, they gave up on sense mixing, so at least I can pause and read the sentences. Okay, first, Will, Dog, and Cool Brad will create a divergent to dis a divergent to distract enough of the bots. Uh, correction, a diversion to distract enough of the bots, so that the base is useless. Since these bots are about as brain dead as YouTube's bots. Hmm. <sighs> And second, we are trying to hang on. I didn't read that. Go back, go back, back, back. Okay, this is interesting. Second, we try to find the main control deck, but we have to pass this door. Pull out your phone for this. There's an app for everything, isn't there? Voice authorization activated. Welcome, new coming bot. Third, you'll need to distract some bots too, but lure them below to the flooded pathway so that enough of them walk to the water and short kirk it. That would be circuit. That's spelled wrong, but I don't care. 
leaving Ted Duck Week without bots. You also need to play this audio over the speakers. Okay. Once enough of them are disposed of, that's spelled wrong, but okay. I'll check in the control room and shut off and disable its abilities to make more bots. That's the wrong form of its, but who cares. Then we'll all try to meet up where the duck is holding Joe down and easy team 113 captive and escape. We only have one shot at this one needs to count. You only get one shot, do not miss a chance to blow. This opportunity comes once in a lifetime. No, no, just something. We'll have to do it when he isn't busy, but we don't know where he goes in his downtime. Hmm, I think I might have a couple ideas. So this is the main control room. <laughs> Ain't this just irony? That troll just doesn't think. Hey, what's up, guys? It's Scares here. <laughs> okay, hang on, hang on. I gotta pause. Let's see. What does it say? What does it say? I'm out of my head. Oh, hurry, or I may be dead. Well, guys, I got to the control room. Surprised it was this easy. Also, I saw the duck, and let's just say he was busy for different reasons. Yeah. Different reasons, or as I like to call it, we can't reveal the exact reasons on YouTube reasons. Yeah, it was that bad. But anyway, now that I'm at the control room, I'm gonna see which room Joe, Don, and Ace are being held captive. Afterwards, we escape. How many of the bots did you lure to the underground? If they say over 9,000, prepare for a major facepalm. We've gotten quite a few, but this place is starting to smell now. It's almost like mustard gas in this place. Who'd have thought even bots would smell like corpses? Have you seen German censorship of video games? Even Will Dog here can't breathe. Also, when they short circuit, they chat random words. <laughs> then you might. Hang on, what did he say? I can't even get to the frame with stupid Windows player. Then you might have to use another room then. Dish the one you're currently using and find another flooded room to have corpses collect. I'll have Cool Brad rewire the TVs to give the duck a surprise when we leave. Is it more totally spies fetish fuel? Because I saw enough of that in the last episode of Neo Quickies. <laughs> Oh, I can't read that fast! I always I always pause like one frame after I'm supposed to. The room's too small. Oh, hang on, I went too far again. That duck. After a few hours, I managed to find the room Joe and ACT are being held. Boiler room 181931. We just pasted that? <laughs> hang on, hang on, hang on. Go back, go back. What did he say? Go forward a bit. Wait for it. Wait for it. Stop. We just pasted that. It's around the corner. <laughs> like. I'm sorry for all the brief interruptions, that, but I'm a sucker for misspellings, but this one... <laughs> you would have to, like, unless you intended to do that on purpose, you would have to be a freaking moron to leave that in. <laughs> Ace, I'm sorry, I don't know what your intent behind this was, or if it was a genuine mistake, but it's so damn funny. <laughs> Uh, 
Ah, continuing forward. Oh, crap, 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 crap. What did that say? What did that say? Got well lined up for you. Let's go. Cool, Brad. Did you ever get those videos made for the hall screens? Oh, is that the Aladuck Ock thing or something? Is that the Aladuck Akmok or something? Let me load up here. Wait, now I get the matter. Here we go, we're getting out of here. And they're out of here. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, guys, listen up. Because, oh man. It's so fucked up. Sure, I am. Was that a friggin'. Why to be fodder clip, or was this part of another video? Like, if this was part of his beg to keep annotations on the screen, then that I can see the genuine emotion. Either that, or he's a really good actor. Either way, congratulations, Down Triple One, you win the YouTube Oscar for being doing that. I guess. So I almost got an animal bots were alive. What are you gonna do? I am going after him. Okay, hang on, I gotta read this huge ass block of text. Well, 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 we meet again. Now prepare to die. You do kid imposter, but and how did you ever survive? Oh, uh, it's the book shack. It's the book shack. We did it up, shut and he had it with no soul. We get out of this trouble, not every and he goes to hell or less. I can't hear what he's saying. Probably because the volume's low and also because the audio mixing is a little off, but. Dan Triple One used Revive. You two try to rest here to regain consciousness. In the meantime... Whoa! Dan Triple One needs me in Will Dog and Pot Shop. That, is that a friggin' World of Warcraft Dark Mask or something? Or is that the demigod of rock from GH6? Either way, it's epic. Oh my god. And his name is John Cena. The duck is blasting off again. Got him. I'm sorry if this wasn't as grand or awesome or epic as most of the YRC's reactions are, but um, it's like the first time ever I reacted to um, something in this manner, pausing along the way and focusing on minute details, but like, it's not just the reactions that people come for in reaction videos. Most people generally want to hear their thoughts and opinions. So given that, I would like to say this video, well, the YouTube poop aspect of it was a little too random for my taste, but that's just my personal opinion. And then it cut to the story part at the end and I liked it. It had a decent narrative. I liked the semblance of effort that was going into it with the lines of script and the edited together pieces of dialogue and I can honestly say it's an honor to be a member of this awesome crew and I hope I can make them proud with the videos I make. I'm trying to be a variety channel but I started as a reaction channel and I will never forget that. Like, I'm, I'm a jack of all trades, a master of none, but hopefully my reactions are good enough to entertain the people. So, until next time, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace. Oh, the YouTube end screen, just almost forgot. Uh, you can subscribe to me by clicking here, donate to my Patreon here, 
check out ECT8113's channel here or click on here to check out whatever video I put here. And if you would like to be notified whenever I make a new video, click the bell icon next to the subscribe button so you get email notifications. Now that I got that off my chest, I'll see you later.